There are basically two methods of ventilating electronic equipment. Firstly, by exposure to ambient air, and secondly, by forcing air around the components. The circuit breaker panel and some components located under the floor are ventilated as the ambient air is extracted. The avionics equipment, which is ventilated by directing air around its components and extracting it through an extraction circuit, includes the main instrument panel, pedestal and overhead panels in the cockpit, most of the main equipment in the avionics compartment. Air used to ventilate the avionics compartment is blown by two fans. It's removed by an extractor fan which ducts the air directly to either the overboard valve or the inboard valve. When on the ground, air is released overboard through the overboard valve. In flight, the air is recirculated through the inboard valve, but there's an option to partially open the overboard valve as well. Ventilation of the lavatories and galleys is different from ventilation of the avionics equipment. Here, the air is prevented from mixing with the air in the passenger compartments. Normal ventilation of the lavatories is provided from the ambient air in the cabin with extraction through the lavatories and toilet bowls. For the galleys, air is drawn upwards by a fan to a connecting duct running along the ceiling of the aircraft. This air is then ducted towards the rear of the aircraft then extracted directly overboard by means of Venturi.